Need some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? For fast and the cheapest coins anywhere, make sure you guys check out MMOEXP.com and use code ZERK for 5% off your order. Link is in the description. The whole thing wobbing. What's going on guys? It's Zarks coming at you today with another YouTube video and today Weekend League is finally here. So I'm going to go over the guys what Weekend League is, how you guys can actually qualify to play Weekend League normally, which you guys can see right now this week actually is open so everybody can play. And I'm also going to go over the rewards, kind of take a look at it, see if they're good or if they're not so good. And also we already know this, but like touchdown packs, red zone packs, all that. I don't believe actually I have a quick sell to them this year. So you just get the pack. There's no quick sell option. Now, I do want to give a shout out to Locked Revolt for being a part of the Nota Gang. If you guys want a chance to be shout out in the next video, drop a like in the vid. Make sure you guys are subbed to the channel. Turn notification bell on and comment down below Nota Gang. Also, I do want to let you guys know if we come over here to my team, of course, it's, it's not going to show right here. But I do now officially have cam chancellor on the team completely maxed out check out my video from last night i posted over here if you want to know how i was actually able to get him maxed out a little bit early and over on xerxy 2 i just posted a gameplay so make sure you guys go ahead and check it out so normally guys to play weekend league what you need to do is actually play through the qualifiers now if i remember correctly what i saw was that i think it said it started on mondays i want to say it said mondays i believe mondays at 4 30 to Thursdays at 4 30 p.m. Eastern. I could be wrong with that. Maybe it's Tuesday it starts, but I'm pretty sure that it starts on Monday. It's not showcasing right now, but as I said, this week is open anyway, so you guys can go in right here and you can play these games. Now, if you saw, you have until Monday morning at 10 a.m. Eastern time, though, to rack up as many wins as you guys possibly can. Now, with Weekend League, there are 25 games that you guys can go ahead and play. As I said, you have all the way up until Monday at 10 a.m. Eastern time to go ahead and play these games. Now, be warned, okay? There's going to be some absolute demons playing Weekend League. Players that are much better than myself and players that may be better than you as well. If you think that you can only go in here and maybe win 10 games, whatever, it may not be worth it to do, but it also could be worth it to do depending on your team, depending on your skill, depending on how much you actually are willing to uh, suffer through to get the rewards, because I'll tell you guys something right now. We can leak. It can get painful. I may or may not have broken a couple of controllers and almost broke my hand last year. So Weekend League can definitely be kind of uh, rage inducing, but when it comes to the rewards for Weekend League, usually we end up playing through all the games of Weekend League, right? And as I said, you have until Monday at 10 a.m. to play uh, to get all your games done and win as many games you possibly can. And then I think it was, I believe, Tuesday at like 2 p.m., they would start to kind of roll out the Weekend League rewards. I did just double check on that. It is Tuesday, so they sent the rewards last year. Now, you guys can see for Weekend League, of course, very similar to Solo Battles, there is going to be kind of a ranking system here. So, if you get number one in the world, which I don't know how many wins that's going to take to get this year. I don't even know how many wins it's going to take necessarily to get top 100. I would guess... 19 wins and with a good strength of schedule it just depends we're gonna have to see the first week's leaderboard and kind of see how many people are split up between next gen current gen because that is obviously going to affect a lot of stuff here so we will see about that but if you get number one in the world you get guaranteed half a million coins and then you get a full legend player and you get the legend tier packs and you also get three touchdown packs so we'll get into the legend tier packs you get there but you get the legend tier packs and three touchdowns 500k and a full legend that's pretty good now if you get in the top 10 you still get a full legend you get 400k and then you get the legend tier packs plus two touchdowns rank 11 through 25 you get 300k a high overall player which is an 88 plus still pretty good and then you also get the legend tier packs plus two tds if you get 26 through 50 you get 275k uh an 88 plus and then also legend tier packs plus one td if you get 51 through 75 250k it's a lot of coins honestly uh you get an 84 plus overall elite player and then you get the legend packs and a touchdown if you get 76 through 100 that is 225,000 coins a 84 plus overall player and then the all-star tier packs plus two touchdowns now as for the legends really i guess when it comes to legend stuff we'll start at the bottom so you can kind of just see what you all get here so amateur is 3,000 coins i'll go over how to get amateur whatever 3,000 coins one hail mary rookie is 10k one hail mary pro is 17k two hail mary veteran is 28k and then you get 
the two Hail Marys and two midfields. Then when you get to star, that's 50,000 coins. And then you get the two midfields, two Hail Marys in a red zone. All star is 70K. And then you get two Hail Marys, two midfield, two red zones. MVP, you get 95K. You get the two Hail Marys, two midfields two red zones, and a TD, and then the Legends. So the Legends is 125K, and you get two touchdown packs. So if you get to Legend tier, which I'm going to be honest here, I'm probably going to be either Legend or barely in top 100. I know my skill. I know I'm not a top 10 player. So if I get lucky enough to rank the top 100, that'd be incredible. But more than likely, I'll probably get around Legend. So you would end up with 125K. You would get two touchdowns, two red zone, two midfield, and then two Hail Mary packs. Now, not only do you guys get weekly rewards when it comes to Weekend League, but there also are monthly rewards, which currently it's not showcasing what the monthly rewards are. But every single month, based on how you guys actually do, you get a reward. So with the Legend, like I said, 17 wins is what you need. So if you get 17 wins, that is when you will go ahead and get the Legend tier rewards, which are 125k, two midfield, two red zone, two touchdown, two Hemery. How many coins will you make out of the touchdowns, red zone, all that? I'm not sure. We have to see the packs. We have to see how good they are. As I said, they actually, as far as I know, do not actually have a coin quick sell this year. So that is going to definitely bring down the value there. I would say you're going to make probably guaranteed though. 200 plus k 250 maybe more it really just depends on what you get how good those packs end up being so that is what you need to just get legend of course everything after that like top 100 all that it just kind of comes down to how everybody else does mvp is 15 all star is 12 star is 9 veteran is 6 pro is 3 rookie is 2 amateur is 1 now as i said uh this is probably where i'm gonna end up is like legend right i might get 17 18 wins that's usually where i ended up last year was around 18 wins i think i had a week or two where i had like 19 wins uh, but for the month, if you guys want to get legend tier rewards, now there also would be rewards for like top 100, but that's really hard to get into. You have to get top 100 like every single week and you actually have to rank even higher than just rank 100 because obviously it based on like averages there. But with legend, it's 45 for the entire month. So really, in order to get legend tier monthly rewards, which usually are really, really good, they might give you like a... I don't know. It just kind of depends. We're going to have to see. I don't want to put anything out there because I don't know what it's going to be. Maybe an 87 plus overall player pack. Uh, and then maybe, you know, you get some coins or some training points. And then you'll also go ahead and get like a 15 times go to better player pack. And again, I don't know. that It's not out yet. So I can't say for sure what it's going to be. But Legend is really, uh, of course, what you really want to aim for there to get some pretty good rewards. So you only need to get 45 wins. And that is based off of four weeks usually. And of course, that means you only have to actually average a little bit over 11 wins. And like I said, that usually is based off of four weeks of games, and then they wait like a week, and then they give you like the monthly rewards. So we don't know what the monthly rewards are. Usually it's based off four weeks, but 45 wins for four weeks seems seems kind of uh, kind of low. I, I think these might be based off of three weeks right now. I think maybe the first month is based off of three weeks because 15 wins a week to get Legend that kind of makes more sense because 15 wins a week is only MVP. So that was kind of how the breakdown was last year. So I'm not 100% sure on if this is four weeks or three weeks yet. There hasn't been like a blog post about EA or anything like that. But those are the rewards. So pretty much go on here, try to win as many games as you possibly can and see where you end up ranking. As I said, the monthly rewards, they're actually not showcasing yet. And I'm not sure if it is based off three weeks or four weeks for the first launch of Weekend League because averaging 11.25 wins a week to get the legend i don't think that sounds right to me I, I feel like it should be 15 but we'll check on that we will see when you release the blog and of course i will update you guys on that information so with that being said guys i hope you enjoyed the video and if you did make sure you guys drop a like the video and of course hit that sub button down below i will be recording some weekly gameplay and posting that over on xerxy 2 so make sure you guys go ahead and sub over to xerxy 2 it should be interesting to see exactly where i end up ranking in the first week because obviously there is a lot of stuff going on right now in the game. Xbox is kind of shutting off. I know this is just like strictly for next-gen Xbox. A lot of people DM me about it. It's not Madden itself, guys. I'm almost positive that it is the Xbox because it's done it to me before when I was playing 2K. Xbox just kind of shuts off mid-game sometimes. So if that happens to me in here, I'm going to be pretty upset about that. But I will update you guys on how many wins I do get at the end of this week. If I had to guess, it's probably going to be about 17 or 18 wins. More than likely. Also, zones are kind of bad right now, so we'll see about that. But hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys next time.